Well, hello, welcome. We're back in the studio full time after our summer of gallivanting around half of Europe. And it's Tuesday Tips Live with me, Phil Morse, here in the Digital DJ Tips studio. Well, thank you for joining us, everyone. Today, we've got a really fun topic talking through the best places to get a cappellas for your DJing in 2021. You know, DJing has always had a cappella use as a rite of passage, right? Putting an a cappella over an instrumental is just kind of like something you've got to do and the earlier the better. But where are you going to get the a cappellas from? Well, we figured out that the last time we wrote about this was actually six years ago, believe it or not. So we're preparing a big article about this full of links and full of uh, extra information on, on top of what I'm about to talk to you about. But I didn't want to wait until that article is published. I wanted to share this with you now. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to talk through the best places to find a cappellas to use in your DJing. Uh, so before we do that, uh, I've just had the word that we can go ahead and do this, which is very exciting. Uh, we've had a competition that we've been running over the past week or so to win $5,000 worth of Digital DJ Tips training. Uh, and the competition is to win training that is in our Digital DJ Lab flagship DJ training program. Uh, it's an awesome prize. Uh, there's actually 10 people are going to win a year's subscription to Digital DJ Lab, which is to keep you on the cutting edge of DJing, training workshops, coaching, 100% original material that you won't find in any of our DJ courses. And that's what Digital DJ Lab is all about. Mixed deconstructions, action plans, stuff around gear, music, techniques, playing out, promoting yourself. It's an awesome membership, which will always give you something to practice and always give you something to improve in in your DJing. And Digital DJ Lab is very popular. We've got many, many thousands of people who have been in Digital DJ Lab. However, we're giving away 10 year-long memberships for absolutely nothing. And the members have literally just been drawn. The emails are being sent to the winners right now. At the end of today's broadcast, I'm going to let 10 people know live that they've won a Digital DJ Lab subscription, which is very exciting. So I can't wait to do that. So that's going to be at the end. But meanwhile, let's get started. And today we're talking about acapellas and where to find acapellas in 2021. As ever, if you enjoy this, we'd like you to join Digital DJ Tips if you're not already a member down here, djtips.co slash join. That's how we can keep you informed and help you become a better DJ or better DJ producer. 150,000 DJs have done just that. And I want you to be with us as well. So if you're not already a member of Digital DJ Tips, that's the most important thing we want you to do. Go to djtips.co slash join. So there's basically been a big change in acapellas. And that is that you don't have to go and find them at all anymore. You can actually make your own. And that is something that is brand new in, well, certainly recent times that's become possible. You know, back in the day, you used to get shady vinyl. Uh, you'd get white label vinyl that would have, um, you know, five acapellas on each side that someone had pressed up somewhere and uh, surreptitiously delivered to record stores all over, the, uh, all over the land. And so you got your acapellas that way. But as soon as MP3s arrived, then websites became the kind of traditional place to find them. So that's where we're going to start off. We'll talk at the first instance about where to get acapellas that are already made. And then when we've done that, we'll talk about where to, how to make your own acapellas. So websites, that's the first place. So the first website I want to talk to you about is kind of like the OG in this game, uh, which is acapellas for you. Acapellas for you.co.uk is basically the place that people have always gone to get acapellas uh, for their DJ sets. Now, acapellas for you is kind of hanging on in there. It's uh, it's okay. It's quite frustrating to use, to be quite honest with you. Uh, and it certainly does feel a bit like, you know, the internet of old where there's pop-ups where you don't want pop-ups and all that kind of stuff. Uh, but nonetheless, acapellas for you has got lots of stuff you probably won't find anywhere else. So as a good start, acapellas for you.co.uk is the first website to check out. But there's new kids on the block and one of the biggest new kids on the block is a website called Vocalerit. So Vocalerit is a uh, is a website that's a lot slicker. V-O-C-L-R dot I-T. V-O-C-L-R, Vocalerit. Uh, it's a lot slicker. Uh, you can get some acapellas for free. You do have to register or log in to get anything. But once you have registered or logged in, you can get some acapellas for free. Once you've done that, you have to start paying a small monthly subscription if you like the site. But that is a much cleaner, much simpler place to find acapellas online. And a second, that's the second example we've got 
of a website where you can get acapellas from. Okay, so that's a couple of examples of sites, but there's other places online where you can get acapellas as well. So let's look at some of those. And I wanna look at stores and record pools. Stores and record or download pools. So the thing with these is you're actually buying them here. You're buying them to keep. So let's have a look at the first example of this. Uh, and this is uh, the DJ tools section of Beatport. So Beatport we all know, right? But Beatport has got a DJ tools section. Uh, and this is packed full of Acapellas. There's loads of acapellas that you can get in here. Uh, so it's a great place to go hunting for them. You can listen to them and you can check them what you want. They're all good quality studio acapellas, which is different to some of the acapellas out there, which we're going to talk about how to make kind of unofficial ones later. And they are worth a look if you want acapellas from electronic artists. They tend to favor electronic artists and so on on the Beatport site. So that's the first place. Um, but the second place, so that's, that's one example of a download store, and there's loads of download stores out there. You know, Track Source will have them, Juno Download will have them. Your specialist DJ music download store will have a section almost certainly that sells acapellas and other DJ tools. So do go and have a look there. But there's a second type of resource place online that you can go to find acapellas, and that is DJ pools, DJ download pools or record pools. So let's have a look at a record pool example. Uh, this is BPM Supreme. So BPM Supreme is a classic download pool. You join, you have to be a working DJ, although their, their, their working description is pretty loose as long as you've got kind of a website or a flyer or something that shows that you've DJed, uh, that you've DJed in front of other people, you can generally join these sites. Uh, and when you do sign up to these sites, you pay a monthly subscription to get lots and lots of DJ friendly new music. And that new music includes, whoops, that's the right camera. That new music includes not only examples of tunes like short edits, long edits, DJ friendly edits, uh, dubs and so on that are just useful for your DJing anyway, but also very often acapellas. So BPM Supreme is one example, DJ City is another one, Zip DJ, Zip DJ is another, Promo Only is another. There's lots and lots of download pools that for a subscription will give you new music, including acapellas. So do try download pools out in your DJing anyway, but certainly as a, another source of acapellas, they're pretty cool. Okay, so we've looked at already sites that are made for acapellas, acapellas for you, vocal it. We've looked at um, stores and download pools. So they're kind of the places where you can find official acapellas if you like. But as I said at the beginning, you can make your own nowadays. And the reason you can make your own is that algorithms and software and AI has got really, really good nowadays at extracting the vocal from a finished track. So you give it the finished track and it gives you back the vocal. Now this won't sound as good as a proper studio acapella. They are getting mighty close though. So let's look at a few examples of where uh, you can find software, web apps, dedicated software and so on that can do this for you. Uh, by the way, if you're enjoying this, all we ask is that you join Digital DJ Tips. We'd love to have you as our latest member. It's free and it's the best way that we can help you improve as a DJ. So go to djtips.co slash join if you find today's lesson useful and become our latest member. As I say, it's completely free. So we're going to divide this up into DJ software that can also give you acapellas dedicated software and then web apps that you don't even need to download anything to use. So let's start off with DJ software. And the one I want to start with is um, basically because it's free. Uh, and this is Virtual DJ. Now Virtual DJ isn't free to buy the DJ software, but it is free to get a version that will work on your laptop. Uh, and the version that will work on your laptop has got all the features. And that means that you can separate stems and export them, well at least record what Virtual DJ is doing. So what you'll do here is, and it's the same with the next piece of software I'm going to show you, uh, you will load your track into the software, you'll tell it to only play you the vocal, which it will do, you'll hit play and you'll hit record, and if it won't let you record in the app you'll have to find a way of recording the signal some other way. But jump through a couple of hoops and you can record an acapella of any track you give it, and the software is absolutely free for using it on your desktop and not using it with a controller. So Virtual DJ is a really good way of getting any acapella you want absolutely free. There's other software that does that as well. Uh, specific, so Virtual DJ is for Mac and Windows. Uh, you could go for DJ Pro AI, which is for Mac, but you can also get this for um, Windows, uh, although, sorry, you can't get it for, for Windows if you want to use this function. This function is only on Mac and iOS. So this is a Apple 
basically an Apple solution to do this. If you want to use it on Windows, you're going to be using Virtual DJ. Uh, this is called DJ Pro AI. And again, it's DJ software that can do this as part of what it does, and then you record the results. Uh, one, this is a subscription software, but one subscription will buy you the software to work on both your Mac and your iPad or phone. So that's another one to consider, DJ Pro AI from Algorithm. Just to remind you, we're, we're, we're writing all this up into a big article, which will have all the links and extra information over and on top of what I'm talking to you about here now. So do keep an eye on that. For that on Digital DJ Tips, I just wanted to share all this with you now while it's fresh in my mind. Um, so that's what we're doing. All right, so that's DJ apps that can do this for you. But what about dedicated software? And there's a lot of dedicated software out there that will do this. The first piece of dedicated software uh, I want to share with you is called Neural Mix Pro. And Neural Mix Pro actually comes from the same people who make Algorithms DJ software. Uh, and this will allow you to extract different parts of tracks and export them. And you can export like the vocals or the drums or the instrumental or any combination of all those things. Uh, and you can even do this in bulk. And it's got lots of features that are designed to help DJs do this. Uh, and so it's quite nice. You can like, um, well, go and have a look at it. Go and look at the, um, uh, at the page on Algorithm's website and you'll see lots and lots of features that are only uh, really going to be useful for DJs in a way that they wouldn't be useful for, say, producers, or maybe they might. But anyway, it's very DJ friendly. So Noramix Pro is a good place to look for this. But there's a couple of other pieces of software as well uh, that our audience really do rave about, although not so many of them, and you'll see why. It's mainly because of cost. These are pro apps. So DMix Pro is $250 to subscribe to it annually or $549 to buy it or $25 a month. So this is not cheap, but it's very, very, very good. Everyone I know who's used this loves it. Uh, and the same with Isotopes RX8, which is a audio treatment software. It's got something called Music Rebalance as part of it. Again, this is not cheap, but it does do a very, very good job of extracting acapellas along with many, many mind-boggling other things as well. So there's three examples of standalone software that can extract acapellas for you. And finally, the final thing I want to talk about when it comes to making your own acapellas is probably the easiest way to start doing this yourself at home. Uh, and that is to use uh, a, a web app, basically a website that will you upload your track and it'll give you back the acapella. And the one I want to show you, purely because I hear people talking about it quite a lot, a lot in our community, is um, uh, lalal.ai, L-A-L-A-L dot AI. Uh, and here you basically drag your track to this window that you see here, and it will give you all the parts that you want to download. You can get the vocal and the instrumental, or you can get other combinations, drums and bass and uh, instruments and so on. So it's quite uh, a nice app, quite well made. Again, this is free, but you do have to pay when you start using it heavily. So that's called lalal.ai, L-A-L-A-L dot AI. Um, Look, with acapellas, there's no right place to go look for them, just like there's no right place to go looking for your music. It could be that you find easily an amazing studio acapella of a track you want, or you might have to use your software to rip it, or just quickly use a web app because that's all you've, you've got access to. But there's always a way nowadays, but more than ever before, of finding acapellas to use in your DJing. And today we've looked at sites, we've looked at download pools and stores, we've also looked at how to use DJ software to do it, we've looked at how to use dedicated apps to do it, and how to do it just by using websites. And there's lots of more websites that are very similar to this lalal.ai. Lots of ways of extracting acapellas, right? So, before we go and talk about this, uh, we're going to spend the last 15 or 20 minutes or so doing that. I'm going to, have to say hello to lots of you who I can see popping up on our comment cam over there. But before we do that, I know that lots of you are going to want to know whether you've won the competition, the prize draw to win uh, one of our 10 $500 prizes where we are going to give you a, um, a year's free subscription to our flagship Digital DJ Lab uh, training program. So I have those winners right here, right now. This is exciting. I'm now opening our internal system and I'm going to read them all out to you. So here are the 10 winners of our Digital DJ Lab one year subscription. And we are emailing you all individually as well. Uh, so congratulations to Garland Clark in New York, uh, to Marco Brandalesi in Italy. Well done, Marco. Uh, to Alison Tooks in Michigan, uh, to Tyler, ha Tyler Hagel in Massachusetts, to Leon Dent in the UK, uh, to Jalil Moore in uh, Grenada, Caribbean, 
uh, in Sunita Shah in Sydney, Australia, uh, to Ellen DeVos in Belgium. You've all won a 500 year subscription, a 500 year, a 500 pound, a dollar, one year subscription to Digital DJ Lab, our flagship training program, uh, to Stephen Mitchell in the UK and to Johnny Rodin in Denmark. So to Garland, Marco, Alison, Tyler, Leon, Jalil, Sunita, Ellen, Stephen and Johnny, well done. Your confirmation email and your login to your new subscription is on its way. I really hope you enjoy being with us for a year over there on Digital DJ Lab. Well done, everyone. And if you didn't win, look, it's not all lost. Keep an eye on your DJ inbox, on your, on your email inbox tomorrow. Uh, we've got something just for you. And whether you entered or not, keep an eye on your inbox tomorrow. You have to be a member of Digital DJ Tips to find out about that. And that's how you become a member of Digital DJ Tips for more competitions, for more prize draws and for offers and so on. Do come and join us. Uh, right, before we go and talk about acapellas and where to find acapellas, and I know there's going to be lots more valuable information from the community in the comments because there always is. I want to tell you about our acapella course. Uh, it's called Acapella Mixing Masterclass uh, and it's on that computer you can see there, but it's probably best if I show you that screen as a zoom up, isn't it? Duh, Phil. Uh, so let's do that. Um, it's called Acapella Mixing Masterclass uh, and it will talk you through how to rip acapellas, how to make acapellas, how to buy acapellas and what to do more importantly when you've got them. Uh, it is quite an old course now actually, it's one of the earliest courses we made, uh, but this is a course that is timeless because acapella use in DJing is timeless. So do come and have a look at this course, it's called Acapella Mixing Masterclass and you'll find it on the DJ Courses tab at the top of the Digital DJ Tips website. Just scroll down to the specialized courses and in the specialized courses, you'll find it right there, Acapella Mixing Masterclass. Okay, thank you for watching. Now you can go away if you don't wanna hear what the community has to say about this, but if you've got time, hang around because you're about to get a mass of added value information about where to get acapellas, how to rip acapellas and lots more. I know you are because it's always the case. Community here is the the reason we're here and you guys and girls are the best. So over to you now for the end of our broadcast. And that of course means my favorite place because I get to sit down here on the comment cam. Uh, so, uh, right, let's go. Firstly, just a big hello to everyone who's joined us today. A few hello, hellos to our regulars, Andrew GM, Loris, DJ Steamzy, uh, to Nea in Barbados, to Willie, uh, to uh, Issa, to Robert, who's in the somewhat sunny Netherlands, to DJ Mustang and Andrew, an extreme DJ PC in Italy, to Papa D over there in hot and sticky Miami, uh, and uh, to everyone else, L LV2D, and all our other regulars joining us. Uh, so I would like you, if you've got a question about acapellas, uh, hashtag ask, hashtag ask, and just help me to separate out the questions. With that said, I'm gonna do my very best to skip through what everyone is saying, all the stuff you're sharing uh, and so on. Uh, so uh, Mixmaster G, hello over there in the Netherlands, getting used to the new time slot. We are always gonna be in this time slot for the foreseeable future people. So good idea to get used to it. Um, so Lou just said, uh, uh, great to see you back in the studio. Yeah, it's good to be back in the studio. I've missed my studio. Um, so uh, all right then, questions and advice about acapellas. Uh, please keep, that stuff coming in uh, and I will read out my favorite ones uh, as many as I can. Isn't there any good software that can extract vocals from any tracks? Says, uh, says you don't like my music. Yep, there is. So that's what we covered a little bit earlier. Software like, um, one I didn't cover actually was x tracks x tracks Stems. Uh, and x tracks Stems is just another version uh, of something that a little bit simpler than um, than uh, the, the professional ones, you know, Isotope and all that lot. Um, it's by a company called Audionamics, I'll show it to you. This is Extracts Stems. Uh, it's this app here. Um, and uh, yeah, you can have a look at this one as well. So it's one more, but you've got uh, Neural Mix Pro from Algorithm. That was another one that I talked to you about. Uh, so thank you for that. Uh, you don't like my music. Um, so uh, uh, a vote for Isotope RX. That's one of the, another one of the ones that we looked at there um, from Fritzelgaard. So thank you for that. Um, Nudaze says you can also use web online software. Yep, we showed you lalalal.ai, uh, but there are others. Um, so um, people are saying which is the best. Well, it really does depend that you get different results from all of these and quite often it depends on the type of music you feed them. Like I find Neural Mix Pro is quite good for hip hop. Um, 
it just depends. So it's worth experimenting with a few of these. They all do work in slightly different ways. They all use slightly different algorithms. So um, apparently acapellas for you is good. You get 30 acapellas a month for free. Well, that should be enough for, uh, for most people, shouldn't it? So thank you for um, stating that. Thank you for sharing that with us. In fact, it's a good, it's a good point. On, on the article version of this, I'll make sure that the prices or free is all uh, very clear. This is going to be put into an article on Digital DJ Tips uh, very soon in the next like two or three weeks. So I'll do make sure that stuff is added for it. Uh, a lot of you pointing out that a lot of these are um, subscription services. Yeah, that is often the case. Uh, vote there for la 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 dot AI or la la lal dot AI or la lal. Strange name for that website, but uh, anyway, good website. Um, Techno Beat says, this looks really cool. I'm a bit late, but it's interesting. Actually, it's worth pointing out that if you have missed the beginning of this or you're just joining us now, we've been talking about acapellas and where to get them and how to make them. You can watch the whole replay on Facebook and on YouTube. So do head over there if you want to watch the whole thing from the beginning. Christian says, I use Virtual DJ for extracting acapellas since I usually play songs with an uncommon genre like K-pop. Well, I don't think Virtual DJ uh, discriminates, but I'm glad it's working for you. That's the important thing. Um, so Craig says, remind me again which iPads I can use DJ Pro AI on. I got Virtual DJ, but I don't use it much. Uh, right, okay, so to cut to, to the chase, any iPhone or iPad with an A12 chip, Bionic chip, or higher, including M1 chip, so A12 or M1 higher. Basically, with iPads, it's anything with a USB-C socket on it. Uh, that's the way to know, uh, and you'll be fine, you'll be good. Uh, so Melody.ml is apparently good for acapella extraction, says Eddie. Melody.ml, shall we have a little look at that one together? Why not? This is Melody.ml. So yeah, looks like another kind of shoe-in for the same kind of thing as Lalal.ai, the one we looked at. There are a lot of sites that do this kind of thing, uh, but that's great. Thank you very much for sharing that. Um, and uh, let's keep looking, let's keep looking, let's keep looking. I'm looking for questions. So many of you are happy about the winners and wishing they'd won, but uh, congratulating the winners of the competition, and that's very good. Uh, for, uh, very good attitude towards all this from you. Of course, we can only have 10 winners among the, the hundreds and hundreds of people who entered that competition. Um, you don't like my music, says, back in the day, you had to dig through dusty crates for acapellas, and it sucked. I'm glad to see that you are being... Uh, not misty-eyed about that, because I agree, it's great to be able to get all the acapellas you want. Uh, so Steve says, here's a good question. Any thoughts about using acapellas on two-channel controllers? So you can do a couple of things to use acapellas on two-channel controllers. You can just use them quickly. So the way we often do it, the way we teach it in... Uh, in um, our mixing power skills course, in fact, it's in our house mixing mastery course, is you have a track on the one deck and you have the acapella on the other deck uh, and you mix the acapella into over the track uh, and then you um, stop the track on the one deck and then you quickly load another one and you start it at, uh, at the right point. So the acapella is playing it on its own for a little while. If your software will auto play a track on load and you get the timing right, you can do it without a gap between the tracks, which is really cool. Um, you know, we are always used to have two record decks when we were using acapellas. It's part of the fun. It's figuring out ways of doing it. Uh, but we do cover this in our mixing courses. So do take a look at House Mixing Mastery if you want thoughts on doing that across two decks. Thank you very much for that. Um, so, uh, lots of votes for acapellas for you. Uh, people voting for DJ Pro AI uh, as software. Uh, can you do a video for the stems, says DJ Rated Bamo. Uh, there's actually a, a lot of information about how to extract ac acapellas in our uh, Digital DJ Lab um, subscription service, which I've been talking to you about today because we announced 10 winners of a subscription to it. However, that said, um, if you're not in Digital DJ Lab, um, don't buy it. Don't do that. Don't do that. Instead, if you're not a member, go there and wait till tomorrow. That's all I'm going to say, but um, don't buy it today. Uh, okay, so I like to create a bit of intrigue. Uh, so Jimmy's just saying, great video. Uh, well, thank you, Jimmy. And I've got no idea whether they're bringing Neural Mix to Windows, Jimmy. Really don't know. I've not heard anything about that. Uh, hello to DJR. Um, so Craig says, what's your favourite way to use acapellas? My favourite way to use acapellas is obviously to find something that's in key with the currently playing track. And then I like to just chop them up and play around with them using a little bit of echo. So I'll put a beat matched echo onto an acapella, maybe a half beat echo, and then use a loop move. So by putting a loop onto like say a, a one bar or a two bar section of acapella, and then using the loop move function that moves that loop forward and back in the acapella, you can come up with some really nice vocal loops. And having them a little bit quiet 
in the background with echo on it's just a really nice improvisational tool uh, so that's how i like to do it and again you can see that in our house mixing mastery course where we go into a lot of depth about how to do that great question thank you for that craig um, this is from DJ2AM. What's the easiest way to combine two songs in one track for DJing with? In other words, the easiest way to make a very quick mashup. I would say probably you're going to be looking at using something like Serato Studio. Now, Serato Studio is great because it lets you do what you're talking about, but it'll beat match everything. So you don't have to worry about uh, getting everything in time. It's just in time. So take a look at Serato Studio. They're probably running a 30 day free trial on that software. They normally do, are doing it at some point or other. Um, Craig downloads from Heavy Hits, which is a DJ download pool. So thanks for sharing that, Craig. Um, what's the best way to use acapellas? Should I mix them in or edit them into a track with Audacity? There's no right and wrong there, Jermaine. You know, if you're going to use Audacity or Serato Studio or Mixed in Key Mashup or any of those programs that let, or even Ableton that let you make a little mashup, well, then you're starting to get into re-edits re and, re and uh, bootlegs and mashups, which is great. But you don't have to do that. You can just mix them on the spot and you know they're both there's validity in both ways there is no there's no rule really as to what the best way of doing that is uh, moises is good online yeah that's another big one actually that i forgot to speak about basically because uh, it's um it's one that we hear people talking about a lot so this is the uh this is the service that you're talking about there a kev human moises uh, it's not actually that's a cappella mixing masterclass there it is uh, so m o i s e s dot a i uh, there we go. Cool. So that seems to be a, a popular choice as well. Uh, and uh, votes for Isotope RX8 here. Um, and um, shame that DJ Pro AI has a subscription to use Neuromix in comparison to Virtual DJ. Well, yeah, it's to use their whole software, isn't it? It's just the way that they, they go with that. Right, people, we are done here. Uh, thank you very much to everyone who's been chatting away. Sorry I couldn't get to all your comments, but listen, if you come and join these on a Tuesday or a Thursday in Facebook, then we will answer your comments underneath because they stay underneath the re recorded version of this live stream. So the place we prefer you to come and ask questions for that reason is on Facebook. Hello to everyone on YouTube and Twitch and so on, uh, but Facebook is the best place because we can answer your questions afterwards in the recording. If you are watching the recording, it's probably because you weren't notified when we went live and you know how to get notified when we went live on Facebook or YouTube or wherever you are, subscribe to the page, follow the channel and click the notifications so that we can let you know when we go live. But no worries, if you're watching the recording, ask your questions anyway, go over to Facebook if you're not on Facebook and we will answer them for the next few days. We'll keep this live and do that. People, I need to get out of here now. So uh, thank you for joining us. Uh, come back again on Thursday. All members of Digital DJ Tips, watch your inbox tomorrow. Uh, and if you're not a member, become one. It's free, that's all I'm saying. Uh, you can save a lot of money by doing that because we've got a special offer launching. Uh, so do do that. Uh, I'll see you on Thursday at the same time as today, uh, 4 p.m. in uh, Central Europe, 3 p.m. in London, and, 11, and uh, 10 a.m. Uh, in Eastern time. I'm, I'm having to remember what the, uh, uh, what the new times are for these. Uh, and these are the new times, people, so don't get caught out. Come and join us then. Uh, right, I'm out here. Get good. Get out there. Make the moments. And until Thursday, see you later. Bye.